Yeah, look at that. Now, this is when I was saying, hey, Dave, yeah. you're taking too big a swing. And you're seeing it on my put coming out. All right, now you're on perfect plane there. Mm -hmm. Nothing going on wrong here. That's kind of where the golf club started, right? Mm -hmm. So now your instinct then goes and you stay on that back leg and the arms go dead left and the elbow left elbow kind of flies so, so what's that first move that I'm making that well remember when I did this maybe I did it here let's see the first move is that I don't think I captured it let me fast forward I want to answer that right away. First move was when I got in here and grabbed the club from you. Mm -hmm. Here's the first move. That's the answer to the mm -hmm. question. We've called it a lot of things, but it's down. See how the shaft's still pointing backwards? Mm -hmm. So it's down, not out down this is that two part yeah, I, I, I see. down now finish it by mm -hmm. this is the part two now swing to the right and finish high with the hands look at that you never finish up there mm -hmm. so that's all counterintuitive training to answer that question you just had now on the few occasions where you did hit it to the right this is that little baby pitch shot I'm talking about. See, the first thing you gotta do is slow down enough to hit short shots. It's coming from the inside. There's that little baby little chip. Mm -hmm. Look at the club. The club's still pointing there. It's such a small swing. That's a great. That's a great mm -hmm. shot for you to still see the club in front of you instead of left and hidden here. Let's just watch you do a, a exercise here. Now that's it. There's your answer. You just did it. So you say, what's the first move? There it is. It's going to the right. Again, easier to do without the ball, right? Just like the full swing. That's going. That's real good there. Right, let's watch the ball. Yeah, there goes the club out in front of you a little bit. Not bad though. Mm -hmm. And the club, the ball went pretty straight at the target, but we wanted it to go to the right. But that was kind of on plane, wasn't it? And yet you were trying to go to right field with it, weren't you? So again, that's just kind of the patient little process we talked about. Oh, let's see, that's a nice, this little baby stuff. You know, if I can't hit a chip to the right, Right. And I can't hit a pitch to the right. How am I gonna hit a full swing to the right? So that's that's the building block. Mm -hmm. See all that. See all that rehearsal you're doing right now. That's that all has benefit. That has value right there. You're just doing something. A lot that's new. See that's perfect right there. You can just watch it. All right. yeah, it's coming it's, from the inside. Okay, okay. That's when you hit yeah, off the toe. That, right? But it was coming from a good path. Mm -hmm. That's just how doggone corn fusing it is for you <laughs> to bring it into that path. So you can see you're swinging to the right. Ball went to the right. Came actually on plane. You felt like it was going dead right. There's your, you know, full swings now become the challenge. There's that little drill. I just, there's your answer. Mm -hmm. Clubs are way back here still. It's not out here. So there's that little in-between point. It's 
calm down. And we're not going to fix it with the backswing. That's pretty good. All right, look at this. Holy cow. <laughs> I'm gonna take out. You want me to print this out and put it on your refrigerator? Not a bad idea. You Photoshop my stomach a little bit, and I. How about that? Alright. Alright, so we just caught the top of a practice swing, obviously. But as we got going here better towards the end, we got into that stop drill. But you'll see here to answer your question. There's still an iron here. That's before I went to the driver. Yeah. Well, yeah. Same thing, though. Right. Same concept. I think it's easier with a driver. Oh, look at that. Well, you had to see it. Yeah. I mean, look at that. I mean, I know I've got to be a year. See, and right now you can't necessarily differentiate. Mm hmm because on most of those, you said to me, yeah, I felt pretty good up there. Mm -hmm. It's kind of interesting, isn't it? I mean, frustrating, but... Yeah, now this is what I need to see. But what I see, this, so is what I, this is what I see. And this is what I know about training. This is how I know how hard things are. You're saying, yeah, I'm going to do that on this shot. Of course I am. So I thought... Okay. Now, I, this is what I've got to work on. So all, everything happens bad from here. Your elbow flies, you stay on your right foot. Mm -hmm. Now watch on these practice swings, how, how your elbow drops. Everything is drops in the slot. There's no flying elbow there. Your hips are moving, club's coming from the inside. Boom. So it's, you know, I mean... It's a this synchronization is, of yeah, movements. This, is, this isn't a you know a single digit cap, a single digit handicap swing, but this is a pretty good swing. Damn right it I is. Mean, really, I you know. Yeah, right, right there it isn't. Look where your club's going, dead left. Nice finish though. <laughs> yeah, I faked it. <laughs> kind of drop. He's like ah. Now if you can get that similar on the other side. <laughs> Alright, let's go to this little drop drill here. Whoops. So we, see, we know what we're going to see. Yeah. Prior to that, we saw the big long back swings. Well, it's just kind of, we did this little. In your mind, you're thinking, man, I got back there that time. Well, this is the drop drill. And and I get to there and you say oh you, even more Dave and yeah yeah that was interesting because and, and, and by the way I love that mm -hmm. but your feeling is it's probably here mm -hmm. I don't care if it gets too long we'll deal with that so there you did and you, you never whiffed it we're not now I'm saying go you just wait for my command. So this is a good way for you to practice it too. It's hard to hit a good shot that way, but, but at I, least I, at I, least I, the I balls are. Every one of them. I mean, they, yeah, but so now your now your mind says, "Oh my God, I can hit! I can make contact." When I come to a complete stop, and Dan said that's as hard as it is mm -hmm. to hit a ball from a complete stop. Still manage to hit it. Backswing that, isn't that beautiful? Okay, so that's obviously this is the key. Oh, stop! Let it feel loosey goosey. Feel I don't care. Look how your body turns. Everything. Well, that's and there's your old finish with a completed backswing. Well, let's just build some trust. stuff well, and then we got towards the end I said alright I'm going to do it one more time 
Isn't that a good, isn't that a good looking swing? Look at your body turning. Well, this is one you chicken put, wing on there, but yeah, I know, but one step at a time. All right, now here's your. This is why I finally said, all right, just go ahead and hit it. Okay, no stop, but feel full. So it's a big negotiation between those practice swings and the ball between you and you. Isn't it? Mm -hmm. There's a lot of talking going on. <laughs> Saying, okay, can I do this? Can I just do it with a ball there? Okay. And that's about 20% longer than normal. Than normal, I know. Would you agree? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. And again, we don't need perfection here. Right. But, um, you know, when that happens, though, it's a whole world, new world for you for mm -hmm. distance speed and now we got to figure out how to get all the moving parts going but we saw some really good looking practice swing sequences there so if we could just magic